Friday, it's 10.35. Um, super rushed this morning. Had to drive way out to like Wake Forest basically to pick up our acai because we keep it at a cold storage unit so we can have a ton of it on hand, but their pickup hours are 8 to 1.30. Obviously, I can never get there um, with my schedule, but we are at the end of our supply. So I had to go there this morning and I got there 30 minutes early hoping I could get in. They wouldn't open the door, so like 8.05, took another 15 minutes for them to bring it out, and I had to load it up, so, and then I had to get, drive back and load it into my freezer, so, um, just under the gun, under pressure, but, uh, drenched in sweat already, and we hadn't even popped the window, so, been going since 6, and, uh, we're going to be coming into Lifetime on two wheels probably, but we're going to get it done. It was like here I slammed my hand down. Damn, about just lost another pair. I'd have turned, I'd have turned around to go get those. So this is set number three of AirPods. And this one just about went out the side of the truck. <laughs> Telltale sign on that parking lot's like that. That line's already stretching. More people are gonna end up hopping out of their cars as we um, really get close. But I don't wanna be a busy one. Rock and roll as we say. tried it two times and I she's got me hooked I'm coming back for more every single week yeah we keep sharing spreading the word therefore the line keeps getting longer but that's okay you always offer service with a smile delicious food thank you guys for all you do one o'clock and it is super busy super warm and we're just trying to Keep it going, we got the tents up, got some uh, customers like straight up tailgating, beach, I think it was beach chairs, I heard that they got their chairs underneath the tent, saw some people out tailgating like in their trunk just hanging out, Leanne. super cool to see that, um, there are people just coming out and Leanne. enjoying the nice weather and refreshing acai bowl, so, um, yeah. We got, we're here till three, so and we do that for the high school students. So, a couple more hours, keep getting it.
Tim, that's a wrap today, super busy. Um, we were on the verge of being out of like everything. We do have a little bit of acai, but fresh strawberries, bananas, and everything. So, um, super busy, weather was perfect. It's Friday, everybody wants to kick off the weekend. With buoy bowls, so we're wrapping it up now. Get the truck to clean down. Head to uh, step back and get this thing ready for tomorrow. Still got Costco to do. Um, I go back to my dry storage, not cold storage. I was there this morning. Um, but yeah, great shift. Thanks to everybody that came out. We're gonna get this thing cleaned up. We're consistently running out of water and we're open longer now and we're busier than we were when I built the first truck and we worked out of that one so a 40 gallon work but we're finding out it's not working on this truck so we're going to need to back up and hunt and try to figure out have like a custom one made like 60 gallons would probably do but then you have to have a 15 percent larger gray water tank and then does that fit underneath so it's an issue we keep having now in this new truck so we'll have to figure that one out For sure, like yeah. that, I don't want to have them both at the same right. place, and we may try it. But um, like they've got those little air, like edibles, like the company that sells like the dipped strawberries, right. and they have those air conditioned cars. I'd like to see what one of theirs would like. Would you have it stuffed with strawberries, bananas? Um, so I was at Busco Beach. The ATV park, uh -huh. and this guy makes trailers, and it has like a restaurant. So that's going to be a, that's so that, that's going to be a barbecue truck. They put the smokers back right. there. Well, no, they, my, right. it has little seats that fold up, and they'll fold down. So it's like a restaurant, like a seating area oh. attached to the food truck. Well, usually those are like the barbecue trucks, they'll put their smoker on the back of that section. Right. Like that. The barbecue trucks around there. I don't like know that. whether you wanted to get rid. Of <laughs> not if you wanted to hang. Now we'll uh, we'll go storefront um, here soon. Um, but yeah, just trying to. I'm so happy for you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, just getting them staffed. That's the yeah. tricky part, yes. you know. Like, find the people, people. That, find the people that want to make money. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So, um, but yeah, let's. Um, we're getting it done, and we'll keep on getting it. But yeah, today was super good. I'm sure I'll find you later this weekend. <laughs> so tomorrow we're in Apex. It's some I'm not really familiar with. It's local or locale vendor events. Yeah, I it's saw somewhere that on the on, list. It's but, somewhere yeah. on 55, okay. and I don't know, and I need to find out. But that's where I'm going tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. um, and then Sunday we'll be back here. Um, and then Monday's super shot. So. And then I heard your wife does all like helps you do the prep work too on top. Yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a family affair. It's now 4.30. We're done. It's been a long day already. Super hot. Uh, even though we've got air conditioning in the truck, obviously it's still warm outside. And uh, it was an early start to get way out to get the acai, and that was kind of delayed, so, but you've already seen all that at this point. We're running behind, but super busy in Apex today. Um, thanks so much to everybody that came out. It was wide open. And we were on the verge of selling out, but we made it, so that's a good thing. And now we've got Costco, a lot of prepping for tomorrow. We're at locale vendor events in, in in Apex off of 55, so it should be a you know a great turnout. It's going to be super hot tomorrow. The tents, you know, we did a poll kind of asking if people liked the tents or if they didn't, and it's kind of a mix. But it looks like. Yesterday and today, people really utilizing the tents after they order to stay under the shade. So, um, if you do like that, let us know in the comments. But we do plan on keeping them just kind of in case because it's definitely hot when that sun is beating down on you versus being under some shade. So, um, yeah, we're gonna 
it's a long day and we still got a good ways to keep getting it so I'm gonna get out of here and get ready for a busy weekend uh, in local vendor events and then Holly Springs Academy on Sunday so again thanks so much for all your attention and if you have not subscribed please do that now thanks